everybody, I'm back. I got lunch. We're gonna do some stuff. Maybe I can unhypnotize the rest of the guys. Uh, can I attack you? Caffeine rush. Sweet carbonated beverages in a pig trough. He's gone. Who would have thought such tiny legs could move so fast? Wow. You made me mess up. Maybe I can try and wake this guy up. Take control of your mind. Is it working? I don't know. Destroy the intruder in your dreams. Snap out of it, you big baby. What's going on? Where? Where's the bathroom? He's back. Quick, act like a chicken. No, tell us where we can find Brady Culture's home for former child stars. We've got to stop that fiend from hypnotizing anyone else. The home? It's a 227 something. Spex would remember the street. He always does the navigating. Can you take us there? Heck no! I've got to take some time out for number one! Well, that was helpful. Well, he's gone. Get into a paint fight in my good suit. Aw. Use it on you. Caffeine rush. Aww. He always sees us coming. You made me mess up. Always sees us coming. You made me mess up. Our vandal is quite speedy. I'm not sure we'll be able to subdue him by normal means. You mean trickery is called for? Exactly. Some say vandalism is the poetry of our time. I hate vandalism, except when I do it myself, of course. Let's get cracking. Yeah! So we gotta trick him somehow. Whee! Not that way. This could use a little improvement. Hey, hey, hey! You messed it up! Oh, now I've gotta fix it, Brain Freeze. Oh, he's distracted. Hit him. Caffeine. Oh, rock. man. He always sees us coming. You made me mess up. Okay, how am I supposed to... It doesn't work on people with... So it doesn't work on people with... Hey, um, quit it, brain feed. Looks like this stuff doesn't work on people... I never travel without my trusty firearm. Um, well, how do we trick him then? Maybe he'll give us a Hey, Spex. Boy, you sure were a famous, oddly underdeveloped teen celebrity at one time. I'm still famous. Are you? Um, like a million point one times more famous than you. Well, we're really more known in the 18 to 34 year old repeat criminal demographic. 
Didn't I see you on an episode of Celebrity Slap Fight? I was desperate. I was heavy into three ring binders at the time and I needed the money. You got your clock cleaned by that lady from Old and in the Way. Never saw that walker coming. Say, how about an autograph for my pal? You can sign my butt! Make it out to Squinky. I don't sign butts anymore. People get ticklish and they move and it gets all messed up. I'll risk it. Sorry, I can't stop painting. This has to be perfect. So, Specs, what are you up to these days? Any new projects? Yes, I have a new light in my life, and his name is Brady Culture. He's the genius behind the Ibo Ocular Fitness Program. You really should try one of his videos. Wasn't Brady Culture your former rival? Please, no one can hold a candle to Brady Culture, the brilliant creator of Ibo. His video made me a whole new man. Sounds fascinating, but enough about that. You can never get enough of Brady Culture's eyeball. Well, that's nice. Let's talk some more about your, uh, artwork. What about it? Oh, nope, I don't have anything. Well, we'll leave you to it. But you have to agree to paint me next! Sorry, I... Okay. No, I know how to skip dialogue. One way. One way, dead end. Street sign. Remind me to refill your prescription. Across town limited. Of course, it doesn't stop anywhere near here. This could use a little improvement. <laughs> what are you doing? Don't mess with my painting. Now I've got to fix it all up. Sam, you're a fantastic artist. I think he missed a spot here. Excuse me. I thought I said not to mess with my painting. Remember our old cut? I said... Okay. He didn't leave anything here I could use. This could use a little improvement. What's the matter with you? Are you crazy? Step aside, brain freeze. They say graffiti is a poetry. Takes me back to my childhood. So I can't go anywhere else that way. Yeah! We gotta go this way. Maybe there's something in the alley. Can I go in here? Oh yeah, I can go back here. I know or I can't. Oh wait! Go back, go back, go back. I once hid in that dumpster to escape a rampaging gorilla. I still don't know how she got out of the office. I was sure I locked the door.
Tampering with the mail is a federal offense, punishable by fine and imprisonment. As we found out after the incident with the garden hose. Ah, memories. Hey, Doc. Hey, Sam. Hmm. Nice decor you've got in here. Very death metal suburban lounge kitsch postmodern professional. Well, you know, last week this was a tattoo parlor, and before that I was a taxidermy priestess. When I'm gone, I'm hoping to be taxidermied and used as a hat rack. You'll do that for me, won't you, Sam? Of course, little buddy. Friendship is a wonderful gift. Hold all my calls. Sounds like you've jogged around several blocks, career-wise. True. I was even a telemarketer for a while. What did you sell? Telephones. But sometimes a brilliant idea just isn't enough. What other unsavory gems are lurking in your sack full of former careers? I was a cook at a restaurant called Ode O. Very strict vegan. We only served water. That's it? Well, you could get it cold or hot. Staggering. I liked that job, but I got laid off when the thermo-vegetarians picketed the restaurant and insisted they only serve the water at room temperature. Typical. I can't stand thermo-vegetarians. Bless you, Mom. I will always say bless you. I think there may be other victims of hypnosis besides yours lurking around the neighborhood. Well, see if you can knock them unconscious as well. Oh, boy! More gratuitous violence! Now I'm recording. Okay, hang on, guys. I'm gonna pause for a while. Okay, 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 okay. I got it. I got it. This time, we are good. Oh, wait. Hang on. Okay, we're back. Okay, you know, I was right in general. I was right. Okay, spray paint this could on this. And then we gotta go here. All right, and then we gotta go. Remember Lou? We're gonna use Lou. Go. Can you believe we get paid for this? I love this country. Go! You made me mess up. <laughs> and now this is quality television. Wait a second. My evil plan is in ruins. The dog and bunny will rue the day they crossed me. Rue the day, I say. <laughs> well, we've admired our handiwork long enough. Maybe just one more second. Okay, let's go. Again, we are leaving. Take care, spatula. Whee! Take control of your mind. Destroy the intruder in your dreams. Nicely done, Sam. You're a natural. Where am I? Who are you? Don't worry, we're freelance police. Police? Oh no! <laughs> Quick, follow that soda popper. In the DeSoto! Uh, we've frozen up for a moment. 
Hurry, hurry, we gotta chase the guy. Get into DeSoto! Hurry, Sam! He's getting away! Come on, game. Come on. Take the wheel, little buddy. Watch out! Gotcha. Don't shoot. Aside from the fact that we just plugged your truck, why would you think we'd shoot you? Except for the obvious sport value, of course. It's just, you always see cops on the news beating up on some guy just because he's a former child star. We would never dream of hurting former child stars. We just need to find the home where Brady Culture keeps them. Oh, why didn't you say so? It's right over there, across the street. Jumping elephant fleas. How devilishly convenient. Thanks. Uh, does anyone know how to change a tire? I love living in a small neighborhood. Oh god, monkey. Disturbing little monkey. Reminds me of a job I had once. You were a monkey? Essentially. Mole man poster. Looks like a shifty character to me. Don't they all? Not much of a secret, is it? Hmm. The black hole. What's a black hole, Sam? It's a star that's been crushed under its own weight, destined to desolate darkness for all eternity. How fitting. Now treating artificial personality disorder. The power of Ibo. Looks more like the glower of Ibo. The yeah, alley of perpetual darkness, is, this like, is it like the area of advanced darkness? I guess this is where you stick your admission form. Locked. Well, great. How do we get in? Why don't we exit? This one's very locked. Hmm. It says here they only treat patients with something called artificial personality disorder. Sounds tasty. What's in it? Apparently it's common in former child stars. Symptoms include, uh, let's see, obsession with money, violent reactions to dentistry, and an unconscious desire to marry one's mother. Forsooth! You don't even know what that means, do you? No, but it sounds all classically literate. Do I have a form now? I put it in the form reader. Whee! I did not mean to throw Max! Hmm. It didn't like it. I bet we have to get that officially filled out by a licensed Sybil. professional. Trust me, I have experience with these things. You gotta go get it proven by Sybil. Let's go. Where are we going, Sam? Back to the office. Here we go. All right, Sybil. Need your help. Since we helped you, you can help us. Help us help you, Sybil. Do you think I might have artificial personality disorder? Hmm, interesting. Symptoms include, uh, let's see, obsession with money, violent reactions to dentistry, and an unconscious desire to marry one's mother. Hey, I know! I could psychoanalyze you! It's gonna be the hard one. 
How do ink blots work? And can we make them ourselves? It's easy. I just show you some pictures, and you tell me what you see. Your responses can reveal things like obsessions or obsessions. Take a look at this and tell me what you see. Susan Lucci holding an Emmy. <laughs> it's also the last time I let Max drive. <laughs> um. The results of the last time I let Max drive. All right. Now, how about this one? Looks. The St. Valentine's Day Massacre. And this? That's a cool design. A squirrel that got run over twice. Now this one. What do you see? A bird. Twenty nuns with machine guns out for vengeance. And this one? Oh, yep. 